Anyone please confirm? Anyone please confirm? Can you hear me? No, it is audible, sir. Okay. All right. Okay, guys, this is a demo class for uh, everyone. So today um, I'm going to discuss about SAP S4 HANA. Okay, so before uh, explaining about this concept, so tell me what exactly meant by HANA. So any idea? So please uh, share your thoughts over here. Anyone? So what exactly meant by SAP S4 HANA and HANA? What is the difference between these two? Anyone have any idea on this? Sir, a vague idea like uh, S4 HANA is on the cloud. Uh, I mean to say that ERP on the cloud. Mm -hmm. Okay. S4 HANA on premise uh, hybrid cloud is also there. Yeah. SAP is update version of uh, S4 HANA is update version of SAP. Sorry. It has its own database when compared to SAP. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so today I will uh, make this concept easy for you. And the own database of SAP. Correct. Okay, so you can see my screen, right? Not that. Yes. Okay. Yes, we can see. Yes. So, see, as for HANA demo class, what exactly the difference between S4 HANA and HANA? So what is HANA? Tell you what, then I will discuss about SAP as well. Everyone, keep your audio mute, please. And I request everyone, please do not record this call. Uh, it's already I am recording. Okay, I already started recording, so please uh, do not record the call. See, HANA stands for High Performance Analytic Appliance. HANA stands for High Performance Analytic Appliance. Okay. So HANA is the database in SAP. Everyone keep your audio mute, please. Okay. See, HANA stands for High Performance Analytic Appliance. HANA is the database in SAP. Yes, for HANA, is the application is a software okay so yes for hana is the application is a software so four means four means fourth generation business suit fourth generation of the business suit earlier we have Version. This is the old version ECC. This is the old version ECC. ECC is the old version. S4 HANA is the upgraded version of ECC. ECC. Also, ECC EHP 6. EHP, EHP 7 is the, it is also the, EHP 8 is the latest version in ERP. This is the old one. Okay. So now S4 HANA 
2021 is the latest version as far as 2021 is the latest version so ecc is the world version so ecc do not have any databases <laughs> one minute see in sap ecc do not have sap own database For ECC, they do not have any SAP own database. Sir. So in the ECC versions, um, the database like Oracle, JD, Oracle, MS SQL, IBM DB2, these are the databases are integrated with ECC. So there is no SAP own database for ECC. So ECC databases are Oracle. MS SQL, IBM DB2. These are the databases used by SAP earlier. Okay, there is no own database. For ECC version, uh, if you look at the uh, world is, there is no own database of SAP. So, but after some time, SAP has come up with a new database. That database is called as a HANA database. HANA is the database. And S4 HANA is the fourth generation of the business suit. Fourth generation. This is the fourth generation of the business suit. It's a software. It's a software. Okay. So generation of the business suit is HANA is the software. It's a programmed software. It's a programmed software. Okay, it's a programmed software. So HANA is the database. As for HANA means fourth generation of the business suit. Fourth generation of the business suit. Fourth generation of the business suit. ECC. So ECC is the world version, right? So they do not have uh, SAP's own database uh, before this S4 HANA database. So earlier they they was integrated with the third party tools like Oracle, MS SQL, IBM DB2. So after some days, the SAP come up with a new database that is called as a HANA database. HANA stands for High Performance Analytic Applets. So this database has been designed such a way that so we can do do the activities in parallel processing. Parallel. So this database. Uh, more powerful comparing to the EC databases. So uh, let's open my system. And I think this is a. So this is called as GUI. GU means graphical user interface. This is ECC and this is S4 HANA. Okay. So I'm just opening SAP S4 HANA system. So this is a HANA system. Okay. See, just to go to system and go to status. Go to status. So here you will see S4 HANA server name and operating system is Linux and database is HANA database. HANA database. And if you see the product versions, double click on this and go to installed product versions. So this is S4 HANA on premise 2020 and Fury apps 2020. So this is SAP S4 HANA. 2020 version. Okay. So you just go to system and go to status and check. So what is the database? Database is HANA database. Earlier for ECC version, world versions, the database should be Oracle, MS SQL, IBM DB2, SQL, 
these are the databases are integrated with the, this SAP. Okay, after some days, the SAP has launched a new database. So this database is called as a HANA database. HANA means High Performance Analytic Appliance. So comparing to this uh, ECC databases, this database works thousand times better than ECC databases. It works thousand times better than normal ECC databases. Okay, so you got the point, right? So HANA stands for High Performance Analytic. It's a database. It's a database. It's a backend layer in SAP. And SAP as for HANA is the software. It's a programmer software. It's an application. Okay, it's a business suit. It's a fourth generation business suit. So it's a fourth generation business suit. So uh, you know ECC EHP 8 is the latest version. Uh, for ECC EHP 8 is the latest version. Nowadays this version is using. And for SAP S4 HANA, so you know, uh, you know Oracle, MS SQL, I, these are the databases are connected with ECC. But uh, there is no one database earlier. Earlier, okay. So after that. So SAP has uh, come up with a new database. That database is called as a HANA database. So this HANA database uh, is integrated with this S4 HANA 2021. And we can run this HANA database in ECC system also. Got my point? This HANA database we can run in ECC system also. HANA database we can run in ECC system also. Because it's the same product, right? SAP's product. So whether it is old version or new version, we can run this HANA database in ECC also. S4 HANA is the latest version. So S4 HANA is uh, so yes, in SAP S4 HANA we can run only HANA database only. We cannot run Oracle, MS SQL, IBM DB2 because so this database will work thousand times better than the normal databases like Oracle, MS SQL, IBM DB2. Okay, so you just understand this point. HANA is the database. Earlier in ECC, uh, earlier in ECC, uh, ECC system, there is uh, no one database. For SAP, there is no one database. So they was connected with the third party databases like Oracle, MS SQL, IBM DB2, and SQL also. Okay, so after some days, after some time, so SAP has launched with a new database. So that is called as a HANA database. This is more powerful comparing than the ECC database. It's a very, uh, it's, a, it's a RAM oriented. This HANA database has been designed RAM oriented. Random access memory. So that's the reason it's a more, uh, it's, it gives more, more, uh, high performance comparing to the normal ECC databases. It's a RAM oriented, it's a memory based software. It's a memory based software. So there is not require there is uh, uh, no requirement of uh, hard chips. Okay, memory cards, etc. Uh, for uh, this SAP S4 HANA. So this is completely based on RAM oriented. RAM, RAM means random access memory. So directly data is fetched from the RAM. Okay, CPU will fetch uh, the data from directly RAM. That's the reason it's a memory based software. That's the reason its performance is very high comparing to the normal ECC databases. Okay, so just understand these points. Now, now what is SAP S4 HANA? S4 HANA is the fourth generation of the business suit. It's a fourth version of SAP. Okay, so many versions are there earlier, ECC 5.0, ECC 6.0, 7.0, 8.0, so like there's so many versions, old versions are there. But this version is uh, uh, has been introduced. This version has been introduced in 2015 onwards. So SAP S4 HANA is a product. SAP S4 HANA is a product. It's an application. It's a software. It's a software. It's a designed based on the program. OK. Now let me open the screen first.
See why companies wants to upgrade to SAP S4 HANA. What could be the reason? Okay, see nowadays, uh, the, why the companies want to switch to SAP S4 HANA? Because a simplification, because of simplification. So 31% is simplica simplification and it will give more performance. 26% is, uh, is the performance and uh, finance enhancement 13%. Fury apps 12%. So what is Fury apps? So nowadays uh, everything will be going on uh, through apps only, right? So end users can work through apps. This is Fury apps. The end users can post the transactions, financial related transactions through apps only. So you can access these apps through mobiles, tablet, and laptop, and desktop. So whichever, whatever the uh, uh, device it should be. So we can post accounts payable related transactions, uh, payable related transactions, master data related transactions. We can also apply leaves from these apps only nowadays. We can sit at home and we can uh, we can see the reviews and we can post the transactions. So we can give the reports. We can approve the uh, respective um, mails and we can uh, approve the leaves, uh, leaves etc. So because of uh, this Fury app zone, because of this concept, so 12% uh, um, simplification is there because of this 12% uh, of Fury apps, right? When the companies, why companies want to upgrade to SAP S4 HANA? Because of simplification, because of performance, because of finance enhancement and of Fury apps. These are the reasons these are the reasons the companies wants to migrate to SAP S4 HANA. Okay. So nowadays, if you look at this document, the manufacturing companies using SAP S4 HANA 20.9%. Okay. So consumer uh, packaged goods companies 10.6%. Retail 9.7%. Professional services 9.6%. So automotive companies 3.0. Banking, uh, banking and finance service 4.2. Utilities 5.0. Oil, gas, chemical 6.3. So now you can easily understand that. So most majority of cases, uh, manufacturing companies are using SAP as for 20.9%. Manufacturing companies are using SAP as well. Now the next point is which countries are using SAP as for HANA? Okay, so United Kingdom, UK 28.6%, US 21.3%, Germany 11.1%, Ireland 3.6%. United Arab Emirates 3.1%, India 2.8%, Singapore 2.6%, Australia 2.5%. See why the companies are uh, uh, moving to SAP S4 HANA? Because of simplification only. So reporting facility is more. So we can give the flexible reports. And it performance, uh, the comparing, comparing to ECC's uh, performance, it's a better. Right, so performance is 26% comparing to other ERPs. Okay. And you can look at this. So 51% plan to migrate SAP S4 HANA in next five years. So ECC version last date is 2027. So after the uh, 2027, SAP is not providing any support to the customers. So it's a customer risk. They want to continue ECC version up to 2030. Okay, up to 2030. That means so last date was given by SAP for ECC version is 2031. Okay, 2027 up to 2027, SAP will grow, SAP will provide uh, support to the customers, SAP uh, customers. After that, they won't provide the support. Okay, it's a customer risk. They want to continue ECC version up to 2030. Okay, after 2030 onwards, only SAP S4 HANA will be there. This is advanced version. SAP S4 HANA is the advanced. Actually, this version has not come recently. So in 2020, it's uh, there. But now it is become very famous because of 
ECC version will be uh, switch off after 2026, 27. So why is why SAP S4 HANA? So 50%, 51% plan to migrate S4 HANA in next to five years. So 51% companies plan to migrate into S4, S4 HANA in next to five years. And 29% are keeping SAP ECC as it is now. So um, some of the companies are saying that why SAP S4 HANA? So um, this is ECC is very flexible for us and we can, uh, uh, our employees also working very good in this system. Okay, and uh, we don't have any problem to continue this. We don't want to migrate to SAP S4 HANA. So like that some companies will say, so that company's percentage is 29%. And 19% are still undecided. So whether ECC or S4 HANA, so there is uh, no clarity. And so 19% are uh, completely mute. So 1% uh, plan to migrate to different ERP system. Like, so some people say that some companies saying that uh, why, so it's a com completely upgraded version. So we don't know. We don't want to uh, uh, continue this SAP. So we want to switch into Oracle or uh, Microsoft Dynamics. So like that, some companies will say 1%. They are not satisfied with the SAP S4 HANA product. This is the market survey. Okay, so the scope is very high comparing to ECC. So nowadays, if you go for any interview, the interview will ask you about SAP S4 HANA. So they will ask you S4 HANA changes or they will ask you how, how to implement SAP S4 HANA projects and which methodologies. They will ask you these, uh, these questions. So what are the benefits of uh, S4 HANA? See, after purchasing the software, companies will get uh, benefited. 70% saving when buying software. 50% saving when buying hardware. Okay, and 20% saving on level. Any new product is emerging in the market, that means the time saving and cost saving, right? So, and simplicity, agility. So, based on these three factors, the companies will purchase the software. You purchase, the, if the software is very hard to operate, then nobody uh, will move to uh, buy this software product, right? So simplicity is the main thing. And uh, agility means simplification. Agility, simplification, both are same. Speed, speed, agility means speed. Speed is there. Comparing to normal ECC, S4 HANA is the high performance. Analytic appliance, analytic reports. It will give you more flexible reports to the management. And now the question is, who will learn this course? So anyone can learn this course, so even if you are a finance graduate or non-finance graduate. So the qualification should be at least a, a degree. Graduation is required for to learning this course. So you should have some basic knowledge on accounts and finance. Then uh, you can learn this course and you can continue this course for the three months. So SAP S4 HANA related jobs. The whole C from finance to banking related jobs will come under the SAP S4 HANA. So the SAP S4 HANA, uh, even uh, this uh, finance led banking companies also using and high IT hard hardware and software companies, recruitments, home and resource manufacturing. These companies are using SAP S4 HANA. So um, there is a much a scope in this uh, industries. So what is SAP S4 HANA salary? The salary uh, range is around 2.5 to 5 lakhs if you are fresher. If you are experienced based on your uh, skill set and experience, so it may be vary like 30%, uh, 60%, 50%. That depends upon the company norms. So before starting this uh, SAP S4 HANA. So we already started, but uh, so before uh, giving more elaboration on the SAP S4 HANA. So first of all, we need to know what is SAP. What is SAP? Anyone tell me? What is SAP? What is meant by SAP?
SAP stands for Systems Applications Products in Data Processing. SAP stands for Systems Applications and Products in Data Processing. System means what is system? System means computer, laptop, any device. Product product means goods and services. What generally SAP will do? SAP will capture entire information regarding sales, purchase, and general things happening in the company. Okay, so SAP is a database software, and it is a business database software. Okay. What is meant by SAP? Systems. System means computers, any or laptops, desktops, etc. Application means software, programmer software. Products means goods and services. What general SAP will do? SAP is a software, right? It's capture entire information regarding the goods and services. Okay, it capture entire business information. Business information means is a purchase, sales, financial aid, transactions, and everything will be captured through SAP. That is the reason SAP is a business database software. SAP is also called as a SAP is called as a business database software. It is also called as a ERP. SAP is also called as a so ERP software. What is meant by ERP? What is meant by ERP? Why ERP is required? For? What is meant by ERP? So ERP. Yeah. Enterprise Business Plan. Correct. So ERP stands for Enterprise Resource Plan. So ERP stands for Enterprise Resource Plan. Tell me some examples of ERPs available in the market. JD Edwards. Oracle. Oracle. Sage, Oracle. These are all examples of ERPs, right? But why SAP? Why SAP? Why SAP is number one in the market? Many times. The Oracle also number one in many times. SAP also. Tell me what is the reason SAP become number one in the market? What could be the reasons? Because of integration? Because integration of stability? With, yeah, integration with the all the departments Correct. of the of the organizations. So because of integration, because of flexibility, because of reliability, because of trustworthy, because of user friendly, because of simplicity, simplification. Okay, because of less less cost. These are all reasons make SAP become number one in the market. Okay, so enterprise means business. Resource means time, money, machine, etc. Manpower, etc. Right? Planning means how efficiently, how efficiently you are using these resources.
in most efficient and effective manner. That is called as a plan. ERP is integrated with the many models. ERP is, you know, if you take any organization, the organization has respective departments, like, you know, uh, sales department, HR department, finance department, production planning, plant maintenance, material management, selling and distribution, so many departments will be there. So this ERP combine all the departments. So why we are, why this uh, why this capturing all the department wise information? Because reporting is very flexible. If you are capturing not only one department, capture the entire data, entire de uh, department's information. In single place, we can see all the information of the respective departments. In single place, in single window, we can able to see HR information, finance information, okay, sales information. So all the information is single uh, window. So that's the reason. So ERP, ERP means it's an integrated planning. It's an integrated plan. So SAP become number one in the market because of ERP only. Because it's an integrated, because integrated with the other modules and a very flexible integration is there comparing to other ERPs. That's the reason SAP become famous in the market. Integration facility is more comparing to other. See, support and all, every company will provide the support. So, user friendly, these are all things are normal. Okay. Because of integration, so reporting is very flexible. In single window, we can see entire information regarding sales, purchase, all information. That's the reason the SAP become uh, very famous and very repeated software because of this reason. Integration flexibility is more. And because of simplicity, after the introduction of SAP S4 HANA, this concept become very easier. Okay, and reporting is very flexible. That's the reason SAP become number one in the market. Number one ERP in the market. Okay, earlier Oracle is also number one. So it crosses many times. Okay, business perspective. See, you know, 75% of transactions is happened uh, only through SAP in the world. In world, 75% of business transactions happen will happen through only SAP software. That's the reason you don't ask uh, the scope of SAP. You know, 75% of business transactions is happening only this software. Tell me what is Fortune 500 companies? Tell me what is Fortune 500 companies? The Fortune 500 companies are listed in uh, US. So they have been uh, given rank, ranking order, like, you know, number one, number two, like that. So a majority of case, 80% of companies are using SAP software. That means top most giant companies are using SAP software. So 80% of uh, Fortune 500 companies are using SAP. And 75% of transaction in the world happening only through SAP software. Okay. Software is a programmed software. Now you understand that what is SAP, what is ERP, and what is SAP HANA, what is S4 HANA. S4 HANA is the fourth generation of the business suit. What is mean to a business suit? What is mean to a business suit? HCM, ELM, SCM. Tell me, ERP. SCM is human capital management, product life cycle management, so supply chain management. So, enterprise resource planning. These are all uh, these are all linked with this business suit. So, business suit including all these stuff. Supply chain management, product life cycle management, HCM. So, others business suits are also there. 
So these are all integrated with the SAP S4 HANA. Okay, that's the reason SAP is a fourth generation of the business suit. Fourth version of SAP. Okay, it's a fourth version. It's a very upgraded version. Okay. So SAP stands for Systems, Application, Products and Data Processing. It's a German multinational software company. Okay, so this is software, this software was invented by five IBM employees in 1971. So earlier it has only one server. So it, uh, see this uh, IBM, this SAP has been started with only one server in uh, 1971. There is only one server. Right now we have three servers. Three servers. SAP is a R3 basis. R3 means real time, three means three tier architecture. SAP is a R3, three tier architecture. R means real time. Three means three servers. So, what are the servers are connected with this SAP as well? No? Application server. So, production server. So database server. So application server is the Fury apps. Sorry. So application server is the Fury apps. Front end layer. So mobile flexibility is there. So you can post the transaction through mobiles, laptops, any device. So that is Fury apps. So this is a database server is a HANA database. This is back end server. This is back end server. This is front end server. And this is middle of the server. So middle of the server is SAP S4 HANA. It's a software, programmable software. So SAP works based on three servers. One is application server, production server, and database server. So database is HANA, the backend server. Production server is the middle of the server. And application server is the Fury apps, Fury apps, front-end layer. This is called a front-end layer, back-end layer, middle of the layer. OK. So SAP is also called as the ERP software. So SAP is a German-based uh, software company. SAP is a German uh, multi, uh, based software company, right? It's the largest German company. Okay. So 80% of Fortune 500 companies are using SAP software. So business suit means SAP ERP 6.0, CRM, SRM, SCM, supply chain management, supply relationship management. These are all part of business suit. Okay, so business suit supports broad range of process for finance, human resource, manufacturing, procurement, product development, marketing, sales, service, supply chain management, and IT management. So ERP is the world version. Okay, ERP means what is ERP? Enterprise Resource Planning. SAP ECC is the world version. So SAP ECC is the world version. ECC means ERP central component. As for HANA is also ERP. Okay, ERP means integrated software. Okay. So this ECC software, um, this ECC has databases like Oracle, MS SQL, IBM DB2. And you can also use as you can run HANA database in ECC system also because this is the product of SAP. ERP means ERP central component. What is the cutoff date for ECC version? ECC is the world version. Okay, so it will be there up to 2027. Okay, after 2030 onwards, no more ECC. Okay, S4 HANA will continue up to 2040. So nowadays, all companies are migrating to ECC to S4 HANA. Okay, so 
the sap won't provide service after 2027 onwards every company needs to migrate to sap s4 hana that should be mandatory so once uh, ecc has been replaced with s4 hana and what is the deadline the deadline is 2027 and 2030 is the last date up to 2027 sap will give you will give the service to the customers after 2027 onwards no okay so and some of the experts says ecc will be there up to 2035 because in uh, s4 hana there are some bugs are finding out comparing to ecc there are bugs are there they are uh, correcting it right now so and so some of the experts are saying that so ecc will be there up to 2035 i told you what is hana hana stands for high performance analytic appliance so it will provide more faster information more faster reports comparing to the normal ecc databases okay so because da data is directly fetched from ram okay cpu uh, cpu will fetch uh, data directly from ram so so it's a see uh, hana is a hana hana is a, hana supports only column oriented tables okay the data will be stored in sap s1 hana database in column oriented only column oriented so that's the reason we can compress the data we can compress the data because data will stored in hana database is only column oriented okay so this points you need to remember so following are the advantages of using sap s4 hana sorry sap hana as underlying database the real time data analysis is uh, very flexible elimination of unnecessary complexity of hardware are not required it's a in memory database and data will be stored in the column oriented okay and it's a parallel processing is happened and data compression is possible so if data we are if we are compressing the data that means we can give the faster performance so the database will give the uh, faster result right so that is the purpose of uh, hana database hana stands for high performance high performance analytic appliance as i told you earlier so um, sap hana sap uh, sap s4 hana is a three tier architecture so uh, like you know application layer presentation layer and database layer so database layer is a hana database so presentation layer is a fury apps okay so fury apps is the presentation layer and middle of the layer is sap hana so you know this uh, sap hana supports so financial planning and accounting accounting and financial close treasury and cash management accounts payables and receivables risk management etc so these are the features of sap sap hana these are all uh, used for reporting aspects like financial planning and accounting and financial close treasury and cash management accounts payables receivables and risk management and many more so this is all about today's session today so i told you about what is sap what is erp what is hana what is s4 hana why s4 hana which companies are using s4 hana and which countries are using s4 hana majority of company countries okay so this uh, who will study this uh, sap s4 hana concept and what qualification is required and what is ecc and what are the ecc databases etc today i explained so just uh, this is a recorded video um let's see the, the, the recording is already happening so you can get this recorded video in the chat box once i close this call once i close this call you will find this video okay in chat box you just download that video so uh, just download that video okay so this is a first class first class means it's a demo class only okay from tomorrow onwards we will discuss the main stuff okay again i am repeating for um this concept for your better understanding see this is aswar hana demo class completely so first i explained about the difference between sap s4 hana and hana s4 hana is the application hana is the database okay so hana is a back end layer 
ओके एस फोर है ना इस एप्लीकेशन से प्रोग्रामर सॉफ्टवेयर ओके सो इट्स अ फोर्थ जनरेशन ऑफ द बिजनेस सूट ओके सो एस एपी एस फोर है ना सपोर्ट्स वाली है ना डेटाबेस एंड अदर डेटाबेस इस अदर डेटाबेस में ईसीसी डेटाबेस वी कैन नॉट रन ऑन एस फोर है ना डेटाबेस लाइक अर्लियर सो वी हैव डेटाबेस इस थर्ड पार्टी डेटाबेस लाइक आरिकेल एमएसएस क्यूएल आईबीएम डीबी टू है ना डेटाबेस सॉरी लेटेस्ट वर्षन तो एस एपीसी ERP ECC ERP ERP it is a the latest version of ECC okay as for hana latest version 2021 so hana is a ram ram oriented memory based software there is no hard hard uh, uh, hard chips okay memory cards are not required so sap stands for systems applications products and data processing system means computers laptops desktops application means programmed software product means goods and services sap is also called as a business database software and it is also called as a erp software what is meant by erp erp stands for enterprise resource plan enterprise means business resource means time money machine etc planning means how efficiently we are using these resources is most efficient and effective manner that is called as a plan erp is a integrated software let's say uh, you can take one uh, organization so one organization have so many departments like hr department finance department and metal management department sales department etc etc so what generally erp will do erp capture entire information regarding all the departments and we can see all the information in single window okay so that uh, makes sense right in single uh, window so we will see uh, sales information hr information okay plant information metal information entire information we can see in the single platform so that is called as erp so so many erps are available in the market jd adwords microsoft dynamics quickbooks people so people so uh, uh, what we call people so so many other erps are there but why sap sap why sap because of integration because of reliability because of trustworthy because of more friendly so uh, sap will give support to the customers and sap launched fury apps this makes the user work is very simplified so many reasons uh, make sap become number one in the world what is business suit business suit is nothing but including all hcm plm supply relationship management supply chain management enterprise resource planning these are all included in the business suit sap is a business suit it's a fourth generation of the business suit so sap works based on three tier architecture so we have three servers sap so sap works three tier architecture application server production server database server so application server means fury apps production server means it's a software programmed software database means hana hana is the back end server okay so these are the so main pointers so this s4 hana supports financial planning and accounting accounting and receivables okay treasury cash management risk management etc etc okay so fury apps so this apps has been introduced by sap in s4 hana platform so because of this fury apps so our work will be very easier so user work will be very very easier so user can post the transactions so from work from home at home he can uh, just open the he will open the uh, mobile and he can post the entries or he can apply for uh, leaves and he, he will provide the reports so each and everything will be there the fury, fury apps we need to download the apps some uh, so fury apps so hana is a high performance analytic appliance it gives faster performance so data is directly fetched from ram okay 
is a column oriented because of column oriented we are uh, your data is completely stored in column oriented tables that's the reason so it will give you the data compression and parallel processing is possible the column store supports is, is column store in memory database so elimination of unnecessary complexity of hardware and real time data analysis so these are the advantages of sap s4 hana i hope so this session is uh, understandable not like a very complex so if you feel it's a complex then we have telugu sessions are there from 6th of uh, this month you can also join in telugu sessions fees is same for uh, telugu and english okay uh, sir i have a question yeah hello yes please hello yes please go ahead yeah yeah sir uh, i have a question sir uh, uh, sir uh, uh, this one we are doing the consultant level uh, training right sir yes of course okay and sir uh, what is the like uh, total code structure i mean to say uh, if you could provide as a pdf like uh, what are the shared the details i think last time i shared uh, the details okay Sir, I did not attended that one because I got to know about your uh, this training batch starting uh, like uh, two two days uh, two three days back only. Okay, okay, I got it. So we will share you the last video. Okay, we will share you the last video so you can also look at that video. Then you will find all the queries. Sir, uh, where where we can see the uh, this video chart. and the last video? In chart only. Here only. in chart so okay so you will find the uh, i'm i'm sorry chart here only here chart so where i can see this uh, these all these two videos in chart only in chart a skype chart so in the skype chart you will find the details okay well it, it is uh, it is in the same like uh, skype only or uh, is will that be in the uh like uh, it is only Gmail, something like that it is only in skype okay skype on oh, right all right skype sir okay. okay 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 all right okay okay thank you very much okay uh, so tomorrow will... tomorrow same tomorrow same, same time same, sir same time okay sir okay, okay fine sir fine. okay fine, right sir. thank you very much see you okay sir see you. Thank you. Thank you, sir.